Jay here with B-Boy. You remember B-Boy, right? Literally the last From video the we did. Yeah. Last time we were sampling some Italian cuisine and this time we are as well. We're throwing down the gauntlet. We're settling the debate. The three famous New Haven pizza spots. We're excluding bar pizza. So for any of you haters, we're not including that one. We got Frank Pepe. Or Pepe. I say Pepe. However you want to pronounce it. It's a modern. I have had this once before. And lastly, Sally's. Sally's a pizza. pizza. So a little bit of history first. Oh. So all those history buffs out there. History time with B-Boy. <laughs> this is gonna a, segment. Be a segment. We got Frank Pepe's, founded in 1925. He's the OG from New Haven. He really did it first. Sally's, following in a close second. Modern, following in a close second. In 1934. Fake. Fake news! And then we got Sally's, established in 1938. So Sally's is last. If you follow Barstool Pizza reviews, Sally's has one of the highest scores ever. And Which, the highest in New Haven. We'll see. So Let's jump in. These are all pepperoni pizzas for the sake of, you know, equal judging. So here's, okay, here's Sally's first. Yeah. We've got some upturned I would say that there's a, upturned pepperoni. a lot of char, a lot of char on the crust. What's thin? Here is modern. Modern is very oily on top. And we'll say. larger peps. Mm -hmm. Large peps. Overall, it just looks a little bit bigger. It's got it looks like bit, a yeah. thicker crust. Yeah, body. We got Pepe's, Frank which Pepe's. is like, it's, it's all good. It's like, it's like real pepperoni. Do you think the other one is a fake? These are like, like, you can get at the grocery store. This one, this I feel like you couldn't thin. get this. Bottom of the pizza, good. Charred in some spots, but not others. No this is a homogenous little bit of char. Okay. Classic thin crust. Pretty even Classic bottom. Crust. The whole pizza, besides the pepperoni, is soft, greasy, and saucy. Same. I don't taste a lot of cheese. And then the pepperoni is just like hard and kind of like bam right there. It doesn't blend with the pizza at all. I will say this is a little bit cold. We have to give them pity point. Not a pity point, but maybe a consideration point. A point for one. The crust is yeah. nice. Or New Haven char to it. I'm not a fan of char though. Me neither. Really, like really not. This is where people differ drastically. So I am not a thin pizza person. I'm I don't. a fan of the char. It's wood fired. Mm. It doesn't mean so it's it has needed. like the smoky wood flavor. Uh, yeah, tastes like wood. Tastes like burned wood. Tastes, tastes like a burned wood. <laughs> not desirable for my pizza TV. We've got a rotating <laughs> camera now. It's pretty Incredible. Nice. Incredible. We're back with modern for our second slice. Definitely looks cheesier. <laughs> Yo, I love this so much. <laughs> in my mouth. I like it better too. It's better than Sally's for sure. It's important to note, Sally's was the most expensive. By like three bucks. Thicker, not much char. Not much char at all. A little, actually, I just showed this in a little char. Mm -hmm. but Oh, mine doesn't. There's generally more of everything on this. Like this char. one has grease that goes into the char, so mm -hmm. the char becomes like softer. Yeah, wow. Which I think I like more. My hair looks good right now. It's a nice slice. Final thoughts, everybody? Better or worse than Sally's? Way better. Much better. Much better. Frank Pepe. Pepe's. What we just noticed was that the pepperoni is under the cheese. I thought there was none at first and I got very upset. So points for creativity. Also looks thin, but more cheese than Sally's. Mm. Also not bad with the char. Did you say this is one of the real pepperonis? Cause I can taste yeah. it. I love this pizza. All right, wait, look at this bite. What do we see? We see no sauce, is what we see. All I see, this red thing, by the way, was pepperoni, so don't be fooled. They definitely did more with the pepperoni. They go light on the sauce. Light on the sauce. They go too light on the sauce. I kinda like it that way. I kinda wanna get lost in the sauce. <laughs> but, whoa, whoa, whoa. The pepperoni on this one is the best part. There's no getting around it. I the know, pepperoni this on this good. is impeccable. It has like an actual kick to it. It's really like herby kind of heat. Yeah. The cheese is also a thick layer, mm -hmm. kinda like modern. And then I guess if you're not a soft lover, it's okay. But if you like the sauce, you feel like you're losing something. Yeah. Likes to get lost in sauce. Oh, that's what I said. Quote me. You will be quoted. Which slice would you definitely reach for again? Modern for me. I need to try a modern and Pepe's like one after another, like immediately. Okay. <laughs> this has turned from the K Bear and Ebert show to the B Boy special. Modern, Pepe's. That was literally half the slice that you put in your mouth. Pretty oily, and pepperoni doesn't have the same flavor as Pepe's. 
feel like there's a clear answer They're here. so close. There is a clear answer here. I think I'm gonna go against what the clear answer is here. Oh no. What they think the clear answer is. Frank Pepe is my favorite. Do you know if you say his name right, your neighbor? No, I don't. <laughs> Let's go one, two, three on the rating. Three. Sally's. 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 Sorry, Sally's. You Sally's suck. Go. No, you, you don't suck. suck. You're well, just lacking. You know, she should be lacking. Two Pepe's. And number one? Modern. Modern for me as well. I'm going Pepe's for number, for number one. It's really just a matter of what you value in your pizza. Cheese for me, I don't know what you value. I don't value too much oil. Okay. Modern had a lot of oil. It's because it's saucy and cheesy and soft. This is true. If I were to like eat a bunch in a row, I think I might go for Pepe's if that was like the case. Like, look. But if, modern, looking, if I were savoring. Modern, if I squeeze it. You have one drop. No. Two, three. I've seen worse. Look at Sally's. <laughs> Look at Sally. Poor Sally. When you got options, she's gonna choose Sally's. No one. Only I'm Sally. Kick her to the curb. Probably not even alive anymore. Oh my god. Well, I mean, all of these were created in 19. They could still be alive. Wait, 19 what? 30? 38. She's probably 30. in mid 20s when she started her business, so she's definitely probably dead by now. Okay. It's getting getting dark. It just got really dark with this. All right, whatever. We're gonna. Move away from that darkness. Away from me. And move into the light over here. Um, I think Sally's could be live. <laughs> I think that she, if she hears what you say when we post this, she's going to be devastated in her retirement home. Sally, I hope you are doing well. She's definitely doing the mamba and still. I didn't say I hope you're dead. I'm just saying she's probably dead. I hope you're doing well too. Sally, I think is a man. What? It shouldn't have an L L Y then. Maybe he was like, just experimenting. He was the OG. Mm-hmm. Back in no. 1938. He said Pepe was the OG. Getting lost in, lost in the sauce. No, he's getting <laughs> lost in the lack of sauce at Pepe. <laughs> Sally's. 5.3. Whoa. That's really low, me boy. That's Ooh, really I like low. Her cheese. She likes her cheese. That barely has cheese. I just have a lot of cheese. <laughs> I get Uno's from Price Right before I get that. Uno's from Price Right. A 6-1. Six, 6-1 one. Six, one out of 12 on Sally's. B-Boy. I'm giving it the warmth point at half a point. I would have started off at a 7-3. Now I'm gonna give it a 7-8. Okay. Out of 12. That's bad. Oh my God. Modern Ooh, baby. baby. Honey. 9.8. She said, I understand this is good, but there's better. That's what she said. A 10, 10, 9 out of 12. 10, 3. Pepe's for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, continue. <laughs> Pepe's, Pepe, Pepe. Oh my God, just pick one. <laughs> Pepe. 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 Is a 11, 1 out of 12. I'm going to go over 11. That's high. This is so bad. Guys, this is so bad. Sally's. Barstool, if you see this, but you won't. I challenge you to redo Sally's score and see if you do the same thing. After it's been chilled for 45 minutes. So 11 1 for Pepe's for me. 9.2 for me. 9 4. Okay. We get these all laid out. I'm eating okay. salads, is why I was confused. There we have the three most popular pizza joints in New Haven, Connecticut. In B Boy, in B Boy, in B Boy, in B Boy. Add some flavors, stews, and marinades. Oh yeah, the lean and cheese. In a pizza pie. I kind of want to get lost in sauce. Lost in sauce. Two, three. I've seen worse. Or because it's saucy and cheesy and soft. Give it to the camera. Wait, they're hungry. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. Pepe's Pepe. 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 Pepe.